all right y'all happy new year's or happy new year's eve depending on when you actually do watch this video before this video starts though if you want your all-star luck to increase by 2.4 percent chance just like this video all right and subscribe to the channel if you're new man all right i daily upload every single day today we're on all-star defense today going to be opening up these christmas presents that we saved up as you can see right here um yeah we got a few christmas presents to open up we'll see who they give and yeah all right let's get it so i got one five star i'm pretty sure this is gogeta um how do i do i evolve it maybe upgrade okay here we go Woo! easy nice so we just got gogeta his name is whatever i'm not even gonna pronounce that dude <laughs> you guys already know the deal is he a five star yes he's a five star nice i just got done making our naruto video that i'll probably just post tomorrow and you can see the base that's on gogeta right here already 6.5 seconds per attack 60 range 130 damage so it looks like he's kind of like broly he might be a hill unit i'm not too sure yet 6.5 seconds in attack uh, i don't really like high attack speed characters but we'll see how this one goes let's go ahead and open up this right here too we got haku okay i'm not complaining about that one wow could you to cost 2500 he's definitely a hill unit let's go ahead and equip haku real quick where is she at not he oh my oh wait what i meant to say he okay haku is a male if you guys watch naruto you know all right go ahead and open up this christmas present now shirtless magician um who is this guy from he's from fairy tale i know that yeah um it's gray yeah gray from fairy tale i believe hopefully i got it right and he is a four star too I'm pretty sure those are the only ones out of this whole update. Maybe. Right? If I just open up this Christmas present here. Yeah, I'm just going to keep getting a bunch of grays. Okay, so let's go ahead and equip him real quick. All right, Josh. So I brought my friend Sumo here with me because actually, if you want to use Gogeta, you need to have any sort of Goku and Vegeta on the map so they fuse together. And I didn't actually have any sort of Goku. And I remember hey, my friend Sumo right here. You know, he has a four-star Goku, or no, this is three-star. Yeah, this is three-star, so but we're living by the three-star, man. We're living by the three-star. Obviously, I had the five-star Vegeta. I I kept him around because um, I didn't know that this update was coming. I just kept him around because, I mean, Manja Vegeta, he's just, he just looks nice. I like him. I like Vegeta as a character, and I think this was bad placement. I totally forgot Vegeta started off as a... Uh, what you might call it? Well, what's the word for it? He started off as single target. It's fine though. We could actually go ahead and show off the Haku now once we get enough. We'll probably have to take these. Hit. Nope. Nope. There we go. Look at that. Came in clutch. So I'm not too sure. Oh my god. Why did he attack every 10 seconds? This three star Goku is sorry, bro. Skip. There we go. Okay, we can place down the Haku now. Okay, so Haku's AoE. And straight off the bat, he uses a cool move. Dude, this is what I'm talking about, bro. All-Star always comes through with these animations, bro. That is a super fire animation. Yeah, that is a super fire animation for Haku. Okay. Um, yeah, we should be fine here, too. Like I said, though, I'm not too sure how this, like, you know, transformation works, this fusion works. So, I'm pretty sure once we have enough cash, we'll just place down our Gogeta down here. And then they'll fuse. Maybe they'll fuse or maybe they won't fuse. They'll still probably stay on the map like these two. They'll probably fuse though. All right, y'all. So before we actually start placing down the Gogeta, I do want to go ahead and max out this gray here to see what he does. Because Gogeta is just going to like wipe the entire map. As you can see right here, um, we'll go ahead and place down Gogeta. He kind of just covers the entire map as you can see. So I don't want to do that. What happened to this? Oh, you sold. Okay, you sold the Goku. <laughs> All right, so let's see what Gray does. Okay, he throws out some hammer. I don't watch Fairy Tale, y'all, so I can't really comment much about this, but I will say that is a cool move. Okay, upgrading him will increase damage and range. Same animation, though. Okay, skip here, upgrade him again, increase damage and range, and now he uses some sort of ice attack. Okay, that's nice. I'm not complaining about that. Oh, I wait. Did I sell my... I've sold my Vegeta. Wait, I'm trolling. Uh, 
Okay, let me, um... Where do I place my Vegeta? This is so awkward. I still want to place him here because I think Goku needs to be close to, like, fuse with people. Or not Goku, but Vegeta needs to be close. Okay. Oh, crap. Let me upgrade this Haku, too. Okay. Now, it looks like if I upgrade him one more time, he will just get a damage in... Actually... Okay, minus three second per attack. So he attacks every two seconds now. This is actually really good. Wow. Yeah, for a four star, this is really good. Okay, I do not mind this at all. This is literally like... Wait, I think he has better stats than five star Kakashi. What? Five star Kakashi just has a little bit more range, but he attacks faster and he does more damage, I believe. Okay, let's see what this Haku is doing right here. Upgrade her real quick. Okay, so Haku doesn't really have that much range to her. I keep saying her. I'm so sorry to him. <laughs> All right, let's skip here. And if we upgrade him to the max here, he's going to do his uh, his ice mirrors. The famous ice mirrors that he does, and it's AoE. All right, so these are not bad four stars at all. Yeah, these are not bad four stars at all, as you can see right here. My boy Gray attacks every two seconds, 111 damage, 21 range. Haku, um, solid four star two, attacks every four seconds, doesn't have the best range in the world, but does 131 damage, so they're solid four stars, I can't complain about them, and they have cool animations, like these are some dope animations, shout out to the dev team, okay, so I think we have enough for Gogeta, so if we place him here, I wonder what happens, I'm just gonna place him down here, actually should I just like place him here? Yeah, I'm going to place him down here. And, ooh. Whoa. They just fused. Did you see that? Okay. And look at that. He covers a lot of the map. He cost a lot to upgrade, though. That, yeah, that's a lot of money. All right. Um, For now, I will place down another one of these gray so we can actually see what this money talk is about. All right. So, 400. 750 and 1500 you saw all the damage increases and the money costs let's go ahead and place down haku too all right so 400 750 1500 and there oh, oh i don't have enough <laughs> all right well it doesn't matter you guys see it though you guys see it uh i guess we could just sell this haku in the back now let's go ahead and upgrade him again though i think that was a damage and range increase let's see what he does here Oh, that's nice. That's final Kamehameha, I believe. Yeah, that, that has to be final Kamehameha. And you can see how big the cone actually is, too. It didn't, like, one-shot these air units, though. What? I gotta level them up. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll be back with y'all once we can actually max this dude out. So, we'll just go ahead and do that. And then, if we max him out again, he will get a damage increase. 10 range. And his seconds per attack is still 6.5. So it's not going to be faster than Mihawk. I wonder if he actually still does more DPS than Mihawk, though. He covers a lot of the map, though. I'll tell you that. We'll have to actually compare him with Mihawk later. Okay, so if you upgrade him one more time, you can see his cone actually becomes a lot, a lot more wide, I guess you could say. So yeah, I think Mihawk actually does have more range. But if you place Gogeta in the right spots, he definitely covers more of the map. Because look at the look at the cone, dude. He covers like half of this. Okay, this is nice. So I guess putting him here probably isn't the most ideal place. I was expecting him to cover like half the map like Mihawk, but putting him right here isn't the worst place in the world either. I'll I'll make use of it, y'all. I'll make use of it. Alright, y'all. So as you can see, all these sparkles around the map, dude. Feels like Christmas. But, you know, Christmas was kind of like... Alright, let me stop. Alright, um... Anyways, y'all. Anyways, anyways, anyways. As you can see right here, with the maxed out Erwin boost, we'll go in one, two, and three. Maxed out Erwin boosted Gogeta's. We'll be doing 1,530 damage. Damn! And we have 16 right now. So not bad at all. We definitely make it to wave 40. Um... We can place down our... Actually, I don't really want to... If I wanted to, as you can see, I can still uh, place down my Vegetas on top of that once we actually max out everybody. But since this is a Gogeta video and a Haku video with Gray, we might as well just place down our Grays and Hakus now. Uh, should we just put them in the back? 
I think we put them in the back. Yeah, why not? Um, I guess we'll just place like one here. Bop, 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 bop. Down there. I, this is bad, y'all. This is bad. Um, I'm just trying to get to wave 40 for sumo. All right, my man's right here. So this is this is probably like the the worst way you could go about this. But I mean, it'll get us to wave 40. That's all I care about. We're just placing down units, just to place them down at this point. Who cares? Okay. All right. Is this Irwin boost about to run out? Maybe. I'm not too sure yet. Uh, let's max out our Hakus whenever we can. I guess. Okay. I mean, we got to wave 40, but we didn't clear it. <laughs> we didn't. Oh, this dude Sumo actually pulled out these. You know what? Why not? <laughs> Why not? Okay. So we know for sure that this lineup cannot get us to wave 40 or clear out wave 40. But now we're just going to place down the rest of our units. Because let's see if we see if we clear out wave 40 like this. This is such like, this is horrible placement, but it's fine. Let's place down our Erwin here. Boost. Oh my god. I'm just trying to rush things right now. I really want to clear this out for the video. Uh, Erwin boost here. Oh my god. Wait. <laughs> do we do this? Do we do this? This is like so horrible. Oh my god, please! Alright. I, I think we're fine. We're fine. Yes! We cleared wave 40 in nano and sumo fashion. I think. Oh my god. This guy has so much health. He... No way. Oh, well... Uh, yeah, I, I spoke too soon. No, he doesn't. <laughs> Alright, well, whatever, man. Whatever, man. We got to 40. I got what I needed. And Gogeta, there you go. I definitely see him as a very useful character, y'all. I know that wasn't the best placement in the world, but if you place him correctly with how his special half of the map target is he can be very deadly i see him being very deadly in the leaf map y'all like he can cover half of leaf with that half aoe dome it's it's real nice so i probably get him to level 80 soon so then i can make a video of level 80 gogeta versus level 80 mihawk and yeah that should be a fun video if you guys enjoyed though be sure to like comment subscribe for more other than that it's been your boy nano and i'm out peace all I gotta do is put my mind to this shit Goddamn. Cancel out my ex, I put a line through that bitch I like all my answers with two lines through them shits